What's good? Common Presence here. We are back with another video today. You see where we at, bro. We in this home setup, you know what I'm saying? Bruce, got the what are we getting beach. into today? You know, I mean, I got the afro and everything like that. So we really want to just come to y'all. This is basically like a calm talk. We want to come to y'all and talk to y'all about life as a, like a small creator on the YouTube platform. And this could spread out to many other platforms. Yeah, so basically it's just like almost, we're gonna walk you through what it's like in our headspace. Maybe if you were looking to do something, whether it not necessarily have to be making content, but you could be making music. You could be doing something in your respective sport. You could be doing whatever you want. More or less, it's just what we go through. Just starting out, you're out here trying to chase your dream just like everybody else. You're trying to take the alternative route. So we're just gonna cover everything that goes with that. But before we even kick off, I need you to do a multiple things. First of all, start liking the video. For like real, the video. like them, like so them right now. So many people the video, but you don't like it. Hold them. on, hold on, give them like five seconds yeah. to like it. All right, that should be good. All right, subscribe, obviously, comment below, but I need the feedback for this comment to be a little different because I need to know if y'all really like us sitting down just talking. We could do more of it. I mean, you know, we're goofy, but at the same time, we can actually have some We've had people request this. So, so I just need to let that to. out there before we get started, but I mean, now I guess we can just get to going. So I guess first we'll go with starting out. Like anything, this is my advice for anybody that wants to start out with like making content or whatever. Don't start tomorrow, start today. So many people, like when we first started out, we did it and it was just like, everybody was saying, oh, let's just wait till 2022 at the time we started in 2021. Oh, 2022 is gonna be my year. No, why can't today, right now, live in the present? The crazy part is the day we did it, we didn't know that we were gonna do it. It's just literally- Waking happened. up, we didn't know. We just, somebody had recommended to us that maybe we should do a YouTube channel because we do all this conservative stuff on Snapchat, Instagram. We just make anybody, most people know us for our dumb videos we do inside of our house or wherever we're out with a bunch of, or a couple friends. But like for the first time, you know, somebody told us, they don't make videos on your own. And it was like, he called me. I called him and he just, he was like, yo, you want to make a YouTube channel? So-and-so said we should like y'all do Snapchat. Y'all do all that other funny stuff. Why don't you expand your platform? And I was like, I'm down. And he was like, tonight? I was like, yeah, let's do it. Let's record it. Didn't and waste I edit time. It. Shout out Yo Yo J for the, you know, the push to get out there. But um, I guess now even so forth with that, I think another issue would also be effort. It's like with us, we knew that this was something that we wanted to take very seriously because it could create opportunities for not only us, but our friends and our family. So my my basically advice to you is whatever you do do it 100 we don't just make videos not only do every person we come across we promote our stuff but we go on omega and we communicate with other people and we go on a bunch of different other platforms to communicate and kind of spread our videos around because it's not enough for us to just post you know and just sit back you know you have to push your own agenda so if you do it do it 100 i'm talking about don't talk about it be about it like if you're making a video or you're making if you're a rapper and you're in the studio talking about some, bro, I've been in the studio a while and I don't uh, care. Mad music. I don't, I but really you didn't don't drop care. drop it? Then it doesn't What's matter. The point? If you had like, stop talking about you grinding if you have nothing to show for it. Oh, I got mad stuff in the vault. I Nobody's don't heard it. care about the vault. Nobody's heard it, nobody's seen it. Post stop. it. Any, I, I know with us, Exposure. anytime we say like, anytime we say that we're gonna like, oh, now nah, this new video is gonna be fire. We give y'all a snippet. Like we have something to say for our work. We won't just sit there and just be like, oh, I'm on my grind, I'm on my grind. Cause a lot of people talk about it, but like do it. Do 100% because if you do a half, it's not even worth it. You just gonna outright, probably flat out fail. I just know with us, it's just like throughout the ups and downs, it's just like, just gotta do it that way. I mean, it's like, People really just fall apart when they don't see the results that they want to see. That's that's one thing we really want to talk to you guys about is results. You will not see them right away. Every everybody takes their own pace. Some people may blow up quicker than others, but that should not discourage you from trying to become great. Yeah, Kai, Speed, all those people, believe it or not, they took over a year or two to even become successful. Yeah. So it's not it's not a quick race. It's not oh put out one two three videos. And then you're and supposed you to get, blow up. Supposed, no. A lot of people quit. You got to be because, consistent. Like a lot of people quit to begin with just because one day they were like, oh, I'm going to start YouTube. Like a lot of people will ask me personally, like, oh, I want to start something. And I'll tell them, do it. Start right now. Start tonight. And they'll be like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then they'll post. They'll get to maybe post a video or two or three. And either they'll find quick success and then the next video is bad or they just start off just with a rough start. Like personally with us, our first uh, video, I mean, we only had like 70 subscribers, like don't, that first video drop. And it got, it like probably what, doubled, quadrupled in views. But then it was just like, we dropped something like another one and another one started doing good. You know, you were averaging anywhere between, I mean, both videos were good, easily get to a thousand. 
Um, but then that next video came, it was only 200. And you're just like, and you're like, whoa. Whoa, what did we do? Yeah. Like, what happened? I thought we were making progress. And now, now you just, it just humbles you. You humbles yourself. You can go through one, two. We went through three videos in that Runs phase, just like being, just yeah. being terrible. Yeah. But it's like, you just gotta persevere. You gotta push through it because if you don't, you're gonna end up like one of those people yeah, that has 20 videos. And then that's it. And then that's it. They quit. They quit. The whole goal is to never quit. You just, you, you just, hundred percent, hundred percent. We are, we are literally almost an entire year in. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> that's crazy. And we have no intentions of quitting. Not at all. Never. Um, I think a lot of people think. Um, I think we had a lot of eyes. We still have a lot of eyes on us, but we had a lot of eyes on us starting off early on because it was just like everybody wanted to see if we were just gonna be funny with it because we're goofy and we fool around. And everybody didn't really take it seriously. But then, I mean, look at us. We're 33, 34, 34 videos in. videos in, and it's just like, bro, you just you did what you had to do. I just hope that this motivates other people to do something. I mean, don't let nobody discourage you. A lot of people that I share my stuff to, they're just like, some people will be like, oh. It's, this is bad, and I'm just like, cool. I mean, like, what? Like, I gotta keep going. You're not gonna always. Not every person in the world is gonna buy what you gotta do. I always tell people though, you don't have to like what I do. Please respect the, the hustle. Please respect my craft. Uh, you don't have to like what I do. There's a lot of people that go, hey, your content's not for me, but I like what you're doing and it looks good, and you pass the eye test. And to me, that goes volumes more than somebody that's lying and it's like, oh, you're so amazing and not telling me the truth about my work. Exactly. Just respect my work. I don't care. Like, listen, most people. There's gonna be people out there that do different things. Like, just because I'm going an alternative route. Some people don't agree, but they respect the hustle. Like, I mean, I'm putting work in day in and day out. I mean, we started, what, nine months ago? And 3,000 subscribers, it's... And what it's I want to tell work. some of the people is, it doesn't matter who or what or when, whoever started this YouTube, like whoever it is between, only depend on you and those other people that started that YouTube channel. Yeah. Do not depend on others. It's not worth it. You no, suck. No. We always, we, we try to get videos out more often than we do already. We, we try to keep a weekly schedule easily, but we're trying to get even two to three video, videos out in one week. Facts. And we just can't do it because sometimes we depend on other people. Yeah, you know and at the end of the day, you can't. I mean, it's crazy because most of our, I mean, we have good videos where people are involved, but like involved, but those are people that like are super solid. I mean, not everybody's gonna have time. Not a, I don't expect anybody to really put intensive care on what we're doing because at the end of the day, it's us. It's, it's us going us. Do. It's not what they want to do. They're just doing us a favor. Like you want to bet on yourself. That's what this is all about. You're betting on yourself. You want to be great. You have to outshine everybody else. What makes you different from the other person that's doing the same thing as you? You got to put yourself out there, make sure like you just carry yourself in a way that will make you better than everybody else that's how honest. i show speed like he's completely different he's crazy you've never seen anybody like him you've never seen anybody like i show speed yeah you gotta put yourself in a different uh category like that even with us like people will always be like oh so you kind of do stuff like Gideon. oh you kind of do stuff like bailey i don't I mean, like hearing that i don't like either, really hearing that bro. i feel like we do what calm impressions does we do what Juan and bruise does we are different we, I think we just, I think we just put more, put more passion in what we do. We're just different. We think differently. We operate differently. You know what I'm saying? We're not, not everybody's really thinking on the same type of time as us. So I just think don't compare me to anybody. I mean, I'd be like, yeah, we do similar stuff. We do. We all, I mean. Maybe the type of video, but if you actually watch us. And I get ideas from us, us, but if you actually watch us and you're actually paying attention to what we're doing, we actually go about pranks, interviews, everything so much more. Than, everything is personal. It's almost like their stuff is like you're watching a TV show, and I think that's really cool. But we make you feel like you're there. You feel like you're there. Like you're that like you want to interact friend. with us. Yeah, like, you're like the third friend. Basically, it's like the perspective of that you are doing the prank, you're doing the interview with us right there. And I want you to take that into whatever you're doing in life, and make sure you know you're, it's going to take something real special for like. I mean, listen, not everybody's going to be like freaking. What's her name? Little Spice, Ice Spice, right? Ice Spice. Like, yeah, she got lucky. But like realistically, the ones that stay here for good are the ones that actually have a talent that separates them from the rest. Say what you want, but that's the most successful people in the world. Kanye, Tyler, Frank. I mean, even like people like Jeff Bezos, Mark Zuckerberg. These are all people that thought that just think different. And the sooner you do that, is the sooner you be more successful. If you just really think about that, though, like the most successful people in the world, presidents, leaders. I wanted to touch on like we didn't really speak on this, and you always hear this. This is like this is the main thing, and I'm telling you guys, if you guys don't do this, you're not gonna get anywhere with what you're doing. And it's really consistency. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm glad you mentioned that. That's <laughs> it, bro. It's yeah. literally consistency. If you if you miss two, three weeks, don't expect to see your views go up That's because facts. people just forget about you. You are basically at the bottom of the barrel. As a small YouTube content creator, there's millions of people out yeah. there just like you. You can't take weeks off. And if off. you stop and take weeks off, you're done. Like, I hate those people that have, like, freaking under a thousand subscribers talking about some. I came back. Why I came back to YouTube or I'm taking a break. I understand mental health because I think mental health is very important. And I feel like in the future with Com Talks, we're going to go in that direction and address that. But I just feel like um, it gets to a point where mental health does get in the way of what you're trying to do with things. But I'm just saying, don't necessarily let that get in the way of your creativity. Your dreams, your goals, yeah. like, what did you want to achieve in life? Your creativity can mm -hmm. still be there. Like, as somebody who, like, I go through a lot of different episodes of different things that I, we will definitely talk about sooner down the line. But I go through a lot. I mean, I personally, people tell me to my face that I am a very different human being. And the things I do is very crazy. And they've never met somebody like me. And I go, there's a lot that comes with that. Yes, I'm funny. Yes, I'm crazy. I make weird sound effects. I'm goofy. But there's a lot that goes on in my brain. And it's not always good things. But do I do I take my L's for the day? Sometimes I'm just like, ah, not my day. <laughs> Let's just, we're going to have to just take a break and settle down. But at some point, I, and I mean, I attribute this to my religion, but I always rely on God. I go, God, there's a reason why I took this L. So I have to keep producing. My trusting, my trusting you is what should make that go away. So I feel like if I sit there and sulk on what's going on, I'm doing a disservice to myself and him. Because even when we have bad video days, I'll be like, shoot, he, God just putting us in the trenches. I just feel like eventually he's trying to see if we built for the lifestyle that he's about to provide for us. He wants us to be great. We are meant to be great. Everything that, this is not a mistake what we're doing, but it's not always gonna be peaches and cream good times. Like there's gonna be times where it's gonna be bad. And he's trying to see what we like in the bad times. Are we gonna sit there and give up? We through a rough patch right now. We are in a rough patch right now. And it's just like, do we stop producing? No. no. I've seen videos after videos after videos, different pranks, different this. We got stuff coming, it don't matter. We got, this video is coming out as we speak. It doesn't matter, nothing's gonna stop us. No, nothing is in our way. So I mean, I guess the last thing I would address is definitely the goals, I mean, we should be at 5K before this year end. I said it on here because 5K. that's true. 5K. By the 5K. end of the year, that is, that's Easily. our goal. Shoot, we should be 10K in 2023. I mean, there's nothing that I feel like can stop. So if we're talking goals, because I know we had asked some of the people on Instagram and some of the people that watch us and that are our friends and stuff, what they so want to see questions. in this talk. Mm -hmm. And so I wanted to use that one. That's the goal. The goal is to basically go in with the full head steam between 5K and 10K because me and him are kind of going into a new era of our life. We're both finishing school for good. Amen to that, we're gonna finish school for good. Sure. And uh, this will be full time. So it already is full time, but this will be the only thing. Let me correction. Only, only thing. thing. Like, this is full time for us. Like we're using up all the hours within the 24 hours. Like I, I sleep, barely sleep, and he probably barely sleeps. Yeah, I barely so, sleep at all. But yeah, that's the goal. We and just I wanna mean, live to do this for y'all. Yeah, so that's just what it is. I mean, we do it for y'all. I don't do this for money. I just do, we just get right. We I appreciate so we every appreciate single done. one of y'all that watch and tune into all of our videos. Especially people from the hometown. Right? Cause that was a little bit of a surprise, you know, cause we, we didn't, you know, we don't, we don't shove it in the white face around here. We just pause, we just do what we have to do. Post it on our socials, push our agenda. And you guys have really done the rest. Like it's really, it was really, it's really good to hear when people are like, oh, yeah, I'm real cool, you. bro. It's like we cool see people we haven't so seen in ten years, and they're like, call me precious. Yeah, and I'll be like, that's like, crazy. Whoa. I watch it. It's like, I haven't seen you in years. Yeah. And you, you still watch. Like I appreciate that. Stuff. Yeah. Like, so they're just like that, and cool. then the people, the strangers that we meet, whether it's through Omega, whether it's through Instagram, TikTok, I appreciate you guys, especially the ones that keep following, that repost our stuff. Keep like, commenting under yeah, our like, stuff. Like, we you see that. I don't see that for that real. Stuff, man. Shout out to everybody. Shout out Vinny, because I know he might watch it. <laughs> and Vinny, he didn't get a shout out last time. And shout out YK Goggles, because oh, he's shoot. starting up his new channel. And I hope he watches this and he takes a lot of the things what we said. It's very helpful. One more person I want to shout out Principal Sling. Oh, yeah. Princip Principio or Principio. Principio, my fault if Principio. I pronounced the Shout wrong, out to him. I hope he watches this. And w. Keep doing what you're doing, because you are a W man, a W content creator. You're going places, bro. Whatever he wants to do in life, I really he, think he, I, I, he, he could do it. He could achieve it in life. Shout out mm -hmm. to everybody. Just all shout out to all the local people that are doing what they're doing in our area. All the small small content rappers, anybody with a dream. If you want to make it to the league? Go make it to the league. Chase it. Stop Chase it. your dreams, bro. Don't let nothing stop you. Nobody stop you. Yeah. So with all that being said, I just want y'all to stay calm. Stay calm. W video. That was a W, w video. W video. <laughs> w video.
And I think I'm the hottest young nigga that's doing it. Can't really name him a better. I ain't no on the violence, but I never back down from shit, boy. I'm with